Dear friends, I am Dr. K. Kannan, Professor Mechanical Engineering, Anjali Amal Mahalingam Engineering College, Koyil Vinni. I am happy to meet you again in the video lecture in the subject Operations Research. This is module number 8, Replacement Model, the first lecture in the Replacement Model. The topic is, we are going to introduce the Replacement Model and discuss the theory of the Replacement Model and uh, will solve problem in the Replacement Model. The learning outcome to the students, at the end of the lecture, the student will be able to solve problem in the replacement model. So, replacement of an item or equipment is inevitable due to the three reasons. One is loss of efficiency. In an industrial scenario, due to continuous working, the efficiency of equipment or machinery will decrease. The repair and maintenance cost will increase with the demand for the replacement of an equipment. So, the, uh, in the machines like uh, generator, motor, turbine, pump, due to the continuous working, the efficiency will decrease. So, the we continuously repair and maintain the equipment. So, when the years go, the cost of repair and maintenance will increase. So, at one point of time, we have to replace the item, the equipment due to the low efficiency. Sudden failure, this is another reason. So, certain item fails suddenly like your electrical bulb or even mobile phone, the LED of the PCB. So, such an item, they fail suddenly. So, they must be replaced immediately. So, this is due to the sudden failure. Then third reason, obsolescence. So, due to advancement of technology, the machine of better design and capability will be available in the market which can work with a better efficiency, make the existing machine outdated or obsolete. So, the machine is to be replaced. So, this is again applicable for mobile phones or the newer technology, the invention of, due to the invention of newer technology, there will be efficient machines available. For example, when the CNC entered into the market, computer numerical control machines, automated lathe entered in the market, the old lathe, old machines become absolute. So, to sustain the production, to sustain in the market, so, we have to replace the machines with uh, advanced technology. So, these are all the three important reasons for replacement of the equipment or the item. So, the first uh, topic, replacement of an item whose maintenance and repair cost increases with the time, ignoring the change in the value of the money during the period. So, the first model, the we take when time t is a continuous variable. So, C is the capital cost of the item, S is the scrap value of the item after some time, T average, the average annual cost of the item, N is the number of years of the item to be in use and FT is the function, right, operating maintenance cost of the item at the time T. So, FT is the function, is the equation relating the maintenance, operating maintenance cost with respect to time. So, the average annual cost incurred on the item is given by T average equal to 1 by N multiplied by C minus S plus integral 0 to N F of T into dt. So, this F of T, the function is required. So, you have to substitute the function here, integrate and substitute the limit 0 to N, we will get an equation. That equation is to be calculated, the value of the T average is to be calculated over the years. The item should be replaced when the average annual cost to date become equal to the current maintenance cost. So, the when the average annual cost is equal to current maintenance cost, we have to replace the item. The second model, when the time t is a discrete variable, so the t average, average time equal to 1 by n into c minus s plus sigma 0 to n f of t. Now, here the year n at which the item is to be replaced correspond to the least average annual cost. So, we take example 1 to understand the theory. 
Example 1, the cost of a machine is rupees 6100 and its scrap value is 100. The maintenance cost is to be or found to be, so over the years, first year the maintenance cost is 100, rupees 100, second year 250, third year 400, fourth year 600, fifth year 900, sixth year 1250, seventh year 1600 and eighth year it is rupees 2000. So, you have to find out when the machine is to be replaced. So, we take the solution. The capital cost C equal to rupees 6100 and the scrap value S equal to rupees 100. Now, we take, we prepare the table. So, year, number of years 1 to 8, C minus S, it is 6000, it is constant because C is 6100 and S is 100. So, C minus X equal to 6000 and maintenance cost. So, as per the table that are given, it is 100, 250, 400, 600, 900, 1250, 1600 and 2000 and uh, sigma of t, sigma of the maintenance cost, so from t equal to 0 to n. So, here first year it is 100, second year 100 plus 250, 350, third year 350 plus 400, 750, fourth year 750 plus 600, 1350, fifth year 1350 plus 900, 2250, sixth year 2250 plus 1250 equal to 3500. 7th year 3500 plus 1600 equal to 5100 and 8th year 5100 plus 2000 equal to 7100. Now, we take the formula T average equal to 1 by n multiplied by C minus S plus sigma 0 to n f of t. So, substituting the value in the equation. So, the first component C minus S equal to 6000 plus the sigma f of t. So, 6000 plus 100, 6100 divided by 1. Similarly, 6000 minus 350 divided by 2 equal to 3175, 6000 minus 6000 plus 750 divided by 3 equal to rupees 2250, 6000 plus 1350 divided by 4 equal to 1837.5, 6000 plus 2250 divided by 5 equal to rupees 1650, 6000 plus 3500 divided by 6 equal to rupees 1583.33. And 6000 plus 5100 divided by 7, 7 equal to rupees 1585.71. And finally, 6000 plus 7100 divided by 8 equal to rupees 1637.50. So, if you look at the T average, the value is decreasing up to the 6th year. End of 6th year, it is 1583.5333. Then it increases again 1585.71 and 1637.50. So, it is found that the, t av the average annual cost T average decreases up to the up to the n equal to 6, then it increases. So, the optimum age at which the item is to be replaced is the end of the 6th year. So, end of the 6th year, the item is to be replaced. We take another example, example number 2, a fleet owner finds from his past record that the cost, of, cost per year of running of truck and resale value of its of it whose purchase price is rupees 6000 6, are given below. Determine at what age it is profitable to, to replace the item. So, year running cost. So, 1 to 7 years running cost is increasing 1000, 1200, 1400, 1500, 2300, 2800, 3400. Resale value it is decreasing. Initially, first year it is 3000. 1400, 740, 375, 200, 200 and 200. So, this is the data given. Now, we have to calculate the replacement age. So, purchase price is rupees C equal to rupees 6000. So, resale value. So, number of years, resale value. So, this that is scrap value C, it is given here from the table 3000, 1400, 740, 375, 200, 200, 200, C minus S. Yes. So, 6000 minus 3000 equal to 3000, 6000 minus 1400 equal to 4600, 6000 minus 740 equal to 5260, 6000 minus 375 equal to 5625, 6000 minus 200 equal to 5800, 5800 and 5800. The maintenance cost. So, it is also given in the table. So, we re reproduce the data. So, maintenance cost 1000, 1200, 1400, 1500, 2300, 2800 and 3400. Now, the sigma of the maintenance cost. So, 
initially first year 1000, second year 1000 plus 1200, 2200, third year 2200 plus 1400 equal to 3600, fourth year 3600 plus 1500 equal to 5100, fifth year 5100 plus 2300 equal to 7400, sixth year 7400 plus 2800 equal to 10200 and the seventh year 10200 plus 3400 equal to 13600. So, this is the sigma of f of t. Now, substitute in this equation. So, the average annual cost 1 by n into c minus s plus sigma of f of t. So, the c minus s 3000 plus 1000 divided by 1 4000, 4600 plus 2200 divided by 2 3400, 5260 plus 3600 divided by 3 equal to 2953.33. 5625 plus 5100 divided by 4 equal to 2681.25, 5800 plus 7400 divided by 5 equal to rupees 2640, 5800 plus 10200 divided by 6 equal to 2666.66, 5800 plus 13600 divided by 7 equal to 2771.42. Once again look at the last column, the value is decreasing 4000, 3400. 2953.33, and again it is increasing 2666.66, 2771.42. So, it is found that the average annual cost T average decreases up to the fifth year, n equal to 5, then increases. So, the optimum age at which the item is to be replaced is the end of the fifth year. So, it is the time to replace the item. So, we stop here. So, these are all the books I have written in mechanical engineering subject. Uh, there is one book, Operation Research. You can refer to the book for additional problems in the uh, replacement model. I upload the video lectures of all the subjects in the YouTube channel. You subscribe the channel, use the videos for your better learning. So, thank you for watching. Please post your comments on the comments box. You can contact me through my mail ID or WhatsApp number for any clarification on the subject. We will meet again with another video lecture in the replacement model. Until then, bye.